Gonna be fine. We're gonna be okay. No one start sniffing above the grass line. Go, 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 go. Everyone get in here. Get your little fat asses. Oh, God. Fear consumed the, the badger mother. Remorse would have to wait for her fallen children. All right, kids, we're gonna make a run for it. Right after he does another sweep true, that's when we run. You hear me? All right, everyone be safe, be calm. One, two, badger run. Yeah, yeah. Everyone get your asses in here. It's okay, buddy. All right, you, gotta, you guys, are, we're okay. Me and your father will make some more badger babies in the future, okay? And get your brothers back, don't worry. As Susanette emerged from the foliage, she looked down on the field of death she had risked her children for. What had started as a simple family day to the Boone Lagoon had turned into a double funeral. Oh! Oh, your brothers! They're dead! Oh! We will erect a statue and a memorial for them. Hip hip hooray. Alright. Now you little scamps, you're not leaving my sight. Who do we got left? Okay, we got Timmy, James, and Bobby. Right? Those were your names from before, correct? Alright. Nope. Get out of my ass. Who is in my ass? Oh, God. Oh, God. Somebody move. Oh, sweet. This is when the Badger family died. How long were we out? Oh, my God. Good thing I have my body illumination enabled. Those scientists. Oh, my God. God, the universe is filled with hundreds of planets. Something was awry in the sky. Oh, oh God. Are you, what, what are we running? We're running? We're running. Everyone run. The badger mother knew. Oh, hello. Hello, Mr. Frog. I would like to eat your face. I can't run. I was going to eat his face off. The badger mother knew that, in fact, the solar system did not have over, you know, 35 stars. Not stars, planets. Something was amiss. Their world was quite possibly a lie. What are we running for, kids? I hear crackling, crumpling. Someone making Rice Krispie treats or something? As the badger family slowly made their way through the darkness, Illuminated only by the mother's love. They inch their way towards their destination. Now, an unknown quest. Alright, kids. Obviously, I have gotten us lost. We are not going to the Boon Lagoon. Uh, I may have gotten your two brothers murdered on the way to the Boon Lagoon. Possibly. And uh, if we do ever get there, we are going to have to have... Enough fun for your dead brothers. That's all I'm saying. Alright, stop complaining. We're gonna eat this frog. <clears throat> oh, God. Oh, you juicy ass. Oh, God. Eat up, kids. We need that strength. Be strong for mommy, okay? There you go. Show me your love with the guitar strum. Oh, I stepped on something. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What are we running from? What the Badger family didn't realize was that these woods were haunted by the slender creature. Did we lose your goddamn brother? Where did your brother go? Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Somebody eat these berries. I swear to God. Who did we lose? Who? Who? Oh, son of a bitch. Your father is going to be so angry at me when we get back. What the badger mother did not realize was if her children got out of the realm of her love, they would be forever pitched into darkness. 
and oblivion. Yeah, so sorry about that, running ahead of you guys. I should have realized that getting out of my limelight, you get murdered instantly. But you know, you, you two were the strongest. Whatever your names are. Bobby and James. That's what we're gonna go with. It'll be changing until you get older and have solid personalities. Right now, you're just kind of like cheap, cheap birds. Isn't that right? Yeah, two double cheaps. Perfect. Okay. And remember, we're gonna have another funeral for you. Oh, oh god. Oh god, where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Kids, kids. You can't just keep running every time something happens, okay? Jesus. We have rules for this type of thing. Hello, Mr. Frog. I'm gonna eat your face off. Oh, you are delicious. Eat up. As the badger mother. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. Okay, good. Okay. Boys, did you hear that? I got so nervous I turned into a man for a minute there. True story. Am I stepping on the twigs? I don't think so. Right? Maybe. Maybe I am stepping on the twigs. <gasps> Is that a house? Is that a pirate ship? Okay, kids. Oh. Everyone be quiet. We're gonna eat this frog over here, you understand? Gonna rip its throat out. Oh, yeah, you are delicious and uh, nutritious. Eat up. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Okay, okay. Kids, you cannot get out of my sight like that again. Remember... Oh, Jesus Christ. Remember what happened to your brother. And your other brother. And most of your brothers. They're dead. Not because of my fault. Because they f weren't fast enough runners. So if you don't like the carrots, you don't like the cheese speckles, then hurry up and eat them. Understand, kids? It's the circle of life. I don't like it any more than you do, but you gotta do it. Hello. I'm gonna eat your face off. Eat up. The Badger family continued northward as they feasted upon the delicacessens. Mmm. Delicacessens. Delicious. Tell me I eat this. It's gross. One day, you're gonna be as big as me, and then you can have babies, even though you're a man. Yeah, no, that's right. It's gonna happen. Oh, God. Oh, God. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? Chill out. Chill out. Mommy's here. Big Mama's here. Big Mama's house. Fine, we'll go left, okay? God. Oh, this is what you wanted? You could have just asked for it, alright? Maybe grow some jaws. Jesus. Unbelievable. What are you whining about? What are you whining about? You're not dead. You ate some gross food. We're almost at Boone's Lagoon. Give me a break. Of that Kit Kat bar. Are these rocks or flowers? <gasps> oh, my poly flowers. Everyone getting the poly flowers. Mmm. Sniff it, everybody. Sniff it good. Yeah, there we go. Who wants a carrot? Who wants it? You want it? Who wants a carrot? Someone eat the damn carrot. Alright, let's keep moving, everyone. I wonder if they didn't die, and they were just like, Yeah, no, we're just leaving, because you suck as a mother. <gasps> a nuclear bomb went off. Alright, everyone, calm down. It's raining lava. 
Yeah, yeah, no, I know. It's uh, pretty horrifying. Let's keep moving. Got some tulips over here. Somebody eat these. Watch out for the burning lava. As burning lava rained upon the death fields, Susanette could only fear the worst. For rain lava meant only one thing. Firehawks. Firehawks, a once mystical and extinct species, had slowly come back after the ages of Badger Wars. Now kids, I could tell you a very, very horrifying story about the Badger Wars. Instead, I'm just gonna say one thing. Watch out for the Firehawks. That's all I'm saying. Something's been eating the food over here. Something that wants us dead. Oh, you slut. I'm gonna eat your face off. Oh, this one's for me. This one's for Big Mama. Alright, fine. Someone else can eat the turd hamster. There you go. You get this one. Come on, kids. Come through the piney flowers. The Badger Mother was at a loss for direction. She had never been in this part of the country. And so her lack of direction made the beaver children, which were at beavers, even more sad. All right, kids, everyone get back here. Oh God, oh my God. We're gonna be fine, everyone. We're gonna be fine. Keep running, keep running. We're gonna make it. Very good, good job, everyone, good job. Oh, sweet Christ. We are gonna get some awesome fox food. Everyone understand? Alright, we may have scared them off indefinitely. So, uh, we're gonna have to substitute carrots. Being a badger is more work than you'd think. See, I grew up as a badger, living in the fields, chewing on turnips and carrots. Every once in a while, I'd get a frog or maybe a hamster. But on the good days, well, the good days, we'd get foxes. Ah, like sirloin meat melting in your mouth. Like someone microwaved a hunk of butter and stuffed it in between your teeth. Let it melt. All the flavor on your tongue like a soft, melty ice cream burning into your taste senses. Those were some of the best days of my life before I turned into a badger hawk. Oh God, are those seagulls? You see, if a badger eats enough food of a certain species, he evolves. I well, it happened on a late Sunday. I was stalking with my brother, James. We were catching foxes left and right like it was roller derby Sunday. And then suddenly, out of nowhere, 747 slams into the ground, explodes into a thousand pieces. So, normally, the firehawks descended upon the plane to eat the bodies of the corpses. As they were devouring a number of survivors, one of the jet engines exploded. A secondary explosion. Secondary. Seven dead firehawks. Dead. Right in front of us. Me and my brother, James. Well, we split the firehawks three and three. We ate them day and night for a whole day straight. Finally, well, finally, we got to the, the middle man, the fourth one. We ripped him right down the middle, chewed him up like old horseradish. And then, well, then I turned into a badger bat, a fearsome creature capable of anything. Oh, uh, you get a little fist. Oh, oh, God. Okay, good. 
watching this badger mother take care of her children. Well, it reminds me of those days. And I just wanted to put my two cents in and my hope that they make it out of this alive. As a strange man slowly talked about past badger incidents, what, what are you guys doing? What are you guys doing? I got food here. What are you doing? Come on. What, what's the matter? Is there something in here? I don't see nothing. There's nothing in here. Come on, we gotta go. What's the matter? What are you doing? Come on. Alright, after this burst, we gotta go. And run. Everyone good? We're good. There you go. Welcome to the real world. Alright, eat up. You're gonna need it, okay? Eat up, buddy. The badger mother had come to a fork in the road, or more like, a knife. She did not know what to do, as there was a standstill in the forward advance of their mission to destiny. Alright kids, your mother's a little lost now, you understand? Okay, I understand. All right, kids, after the next wave, we gotta run like a bum rush and like a bat out of hell, you understand? One, two, go. Alpha Team Bravo on the, on the scene. Everyone hide, everyone hide behind the big rocks. One, two, go, move. Oh, oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh, all right, we can hide behind here. Could have made it to the next one, whatever. One, two, go! Oh, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. We're waiting back here, wait back here, wait back here. As the waves pummeled the Badger Queen, she could only hope that their future was secured by fate and fate alone. Kids, get in here. I only got two of you left. I ain't losing no more. I want some grandchildren. I'm getting a little wet, but I can deal with that. That's life. You understand? Everyone get in this little nook. Get get some nook with your moms. Alright, come on. Come on. Come on. Never give up. Never give up, kids. We're gonna make it out of this. We're gonna make it out of this hell. We're gonna tell our kids about this, alright? Wipe yourselves off. Cheer your cheerio eyes and let's kick some ass. Alright. Next one's gonna be tough, everyone. Go! Oh god. Okay, we can do this. We can do this, guys. The waves seem to never end. In fact, the Badger Mother was unsure if, in fact, there was safety at the end of this Death River. Come on, kids. Come on. Finally, they'd reached safe haven. Fire lava, or rain lava, was still falling upon the land. But their worries had fallen off. At least for the time being. Good job, everyone. Eat a carrot. Get your carrots, alright? Carrots and tulips. Come on, eat up, kids. Okay, we can do this. Are these little rocks? Nope. Oh, these are cauliflower plants. Oh, okay. What the smaller badgers did not know was their mother was 24-7 wasted. Just kidding. She wasn't wasted. <gasps> Kids, I am going to eat that frog so hard that it's going to, you're going to think like I haven't eaten in days. Oh, you are delicious. Who wants frog? It's on a menu. Come on. 
Come on, come on, run. Run for the- you oh god, oh god. Oh, I got- I still got the frog in my mouth. Come on. Okay. Okay, we got this. We got this. We got this. You know what I just realized? I can carry food in case one of you dies. My god. This is an epiphany to me. And as the sun rose once more, the Badger family continued on.